Hey everybody, Game Industrials here. Welcome back to Super Win the Game. Now, for most of the video, it's going to be us getting, I believe, the remaining hearts and going through this one weird area. Okay. So we're back in the Glacial Palace. Uh, the Glacier. Oh, you- Oh! Oh, how's I supposed to fucking know that? Come on, man. You gotta find that blue block of dogs or that bullet hell. <laughs> I've been on this stage for hours trying to get by this. <laughs> if you read the book, will you die? Hopefully not. Oh, you should know the reference. <laughs> oh, that tells you a door. Yup. <laughs> yeah, the darn ghost is a uh, diary. You yeah, watch you... it a few times and then you just die. Yup, cause you told me not to read it. <laughs> yep. Hey, you paid the price. Okay. This is a safe oh, place. They won't find me here. Oh, I'm sure they will. <laughs> oh, yeah, you heard uh, Alistair Beck. He might leave Jackley er early. Because it's all uh, cancer. It's all cancer, uh, thing. Uh, yes. Hello, Marvelous 3. Back for What the? Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on, man. They got a first for jumping in the freaking fit to find something. Come on! <laughs> like back of the sky pillars were another kind of inconspicuous spot to find the next heart. Oh yeah, remember Tassel Town when they had Genie Hero? That was the yeah. main reason why I died there a thousand times because I was trying to find a secret by sinking in the sand. But I was curious! There could have been a freaking heart piece down there or whatever. Oh yeah. Every time I see a quicksand, I just, I just think they're on purpose, and I keep dying. <laughs> yeah. Wait, another heart obtained. Yep, that was easy. Now oh, I got a transition. <laughs> now we're in the waterways. Alright. Mm -mm. Sounds catchy, though, that music. Wait. Okay, got that one. Alright. See you on the other side, Africa. Bam! <laughs> oh, oh shit. Wow, now we're now we're in hell. <laughs> oh, welcome to hell. What the fuck is? Tell from the hood. <laughs> Yo, you try watching that with your little kid, that scene will scare the living shit out of you. Not Did surprised. You, yeah, you found out that the, 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 the reverend... He, he wasn't no reverend, he was the devil. Gosh, yeah. Whoa. Yeah. And the three dudes, they were there all along. Oh. So there's also green gems, cut too. Or at least part of the uh, 120 gems you got fine. The green gem. This ain't Crash Bandicoot. I think they're just part of the 128. Oh, come on! A, a hit and wall? Yeah, I wasn't expecting <laughs> that. Oh my god, it's like- Oh my god, it's like in Crash 2, we had to walk through that one wall to get the green gem. How cliche it is. <laughs> in that sewer level. No! <laughs> and it's another green gem. Now break a certain amount of boxes. A lock has opened somewhere. Let me guess. Hold it down for five seconds, sink through that white floor. Negative. <laughs> you know, I was just ran with this and some dub music over Mario Brothers. Just for the hell of it. What's down below? That's the question. A snake? Snake, snake, snake. You sound like a snake. S 
Yeah, I don't know no snakes. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot, I, I, I want to watch that soon since uh, it's about that time of year in two in um in three months. Oh, it's two months. Yeah, right, two months. <sighs> oh, excuse me. It'll probably be on TV in the next couple days. Y'all. Yeah. It'll take three days for it to go live on television. Yeah, I was watching a few clips of it. The scene when they when they woke up late because a dumbass Peter is going to unplug the alarm clock. <laughs> and he, he, he didn't reset the timer. He didn't reset the, the, the alarm clock. Idiots. So that wake up call was all on Peter. <laughs> By the way, I was watching the Everything Wrong with Home Alone when it comes to that scene, and it definitely said that alarm clock has a battery backup. <laughs> <laughs> How about this side poop? Look at that side poop. You like this side poop? Well, you shouldn't. This is mine. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Thanks, Peter. Just, that was just gross. I think it was still dumb enough when Peter tried to learn how to sit down in a chair. Sees a chair, just <laughs> tackles it instead. Oh, fuck. That was <laughs> Oh, damn shit. <sighs> oh! <laughs> Fuck the hell with this uh, stage here. Watch for little tiny balls. Yeah, no. Ooh. Oh, oh come on! Oh, that, that's bullshit too! <laughs> I mean, at least it's not as annoying as the frickin' eyeball. Oh, yeah, that was bullshit too. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, the way how you said little balls, we were dating that one quote with Scary Movie 3 where Kevin Hart was trying to get the, the peanuts and Andy Aaron says, What are you trying to do? I'm just trying to get some nuts. <laughs> <laughs> so people can take it the wrong way though. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's your aggressive peanuts. You got that, some nuts, you know, there. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> That's the real thing to say. <laughs> <laughs> Ding, go back right down. <laughs> I don't remember the family episode with uh, the hillbillies and uh, rednecks. Uh, had Stewie uh, play on the banjo. I remember that. <laughs> warm that day. Warm yesterday. Even warm today. <laughs> I, remember, I remember when Stewie wouldn't let anyone kill Lois. Lois? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he stopped doing it after that dream he had where he finally was gonna do finally got that chance to do it. Yeah. And then after that he just stopped doing it, period. Yeah. He was just done killing her and then afterwards. Oh yeah, who who that was the one Brian died? That was terrible. Yeah, he got ran by a car. And they brought him a replacement, which did last for several episodes. Oh yeah, he was he was voiced by the guy from the Sopranos. Bolly Walnuts. Yeah, they they weren't really happy with having him there as the replacement for Ryan. <laughs> I know, he didn't so, fit at all. So they made an episode where they time trap bad to save Brian. Yeah. And now Brian returns again. Yeah, even I that one, it. Even in one episode where they had the perfect dog, and he apparently humped um, Rupert. He humped a teddy bear. I feel like Okay. And it just shows Stewie bringing a garbage bag with the dead carbs of uh, the, the, the new dog. Boy, fuck. I remember the Mia didn't even... I remember the Mia... Some of the Mia... Some of the uh, Mia first didn't even knew that uh, Brian came back from the dead. <laughs> they, they thought he was still dead. Like, uh, no, they brought him back. Well, it went back... They went back in time, I think. I think yeah. they tried back for that, so... Yeah, that Brian was so Stewie that did that. Yeah. Yeah, they did the right thing. <laughs> yeah, his death scene was so his death scene was so gruesome. Well, yeah, it's a pet that died. That's yeah, that's, on, that's, on that's a family member. That's a family member of theirs. Yeah, it's horrible. I know. Yeah, but even that was pretty dark for Family Guy. I know. Yeah, on, yeah, on, yeah. on Channel Fox, not HBO for that fact, but Fox. <laughs> Well, I mean, I'm sure the dark things have other other uh, 
shows and such at times. I mean, I don't know if anyone else has, but I'm sure this was his family had done it. Finally, he got down there. <laughs> Good grief, that was a pain in the ass. And look, we're right back. Whoa! There. Oh, that was close. I was like, was that was that looping or something? Pretty much. Oh gosh. Yeah, I was told that Ron the dog had died before I watched it. I'm like, okay, I had to see how that shit went down. Yeah, I saw it different on there too. The first, I'm like, wait, what happened to Brian? <laughs> and then I was like, oh no. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. Don't do that, guys. And then they would fix it, bring it back. Like, okay, good. <laughs> don't do, don't do that again. I mean, Brian does stupid things at times, but we don't want to lose him though, regardless. Yeah. It was even odd, it was even weird that Brian was on a sh on a new or a new show or whatever. Or, I don't know what the show it was, but he was with by actual human beings. Maybe you're watching like real life TV, and Brian being the animated character on there with the others, which seemed very odd. Oh yeah, there was an episode where Brian took his whole fur off and made Peter touch him. That episode was so disturbing. The fuck? <laughs> I know what you're yeah. talking about. <laughs> I never remember that before. Why do you have so many nipples? <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, yeah, dogs and cats have a lot more nipples than uh, human beings. Yeah, they do. Humans only have two, cats and dogs have like maybe... Especially female dogs. It's like six or eight at least. I know they got a lot on them. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh yeah, he was—he was with those human beings. He was—he was trying to promote his book about the wish it wanted to do it. That's a little weird for a name of a book. No instinctivity. Well, let's see. Lucidity achieved. Lucidity. I know exactly what I'm doing. I don't know about that goddamn salt and potato salad. I'm making this up as I go. <laughs> He's for Brian, and look, he's colorful now. Oh yeah, oh. I was uh, prior to the next scene where really, uh, he put a lot of salt in the potato salad. <laughs> like, come on, we don't, we don't need that, we don't have any salt in the potato salad. You know, it took us three days to make that potato salad. <laughs> three days! <laughs> well, yeah, I was go. watching, uh, I was watching Rogue in Paris, uh, the other day on Netflix, and there was a Mario 64 reference in that scene. The scene where, uh, what was Neil grab uh, right up by the tail, he swoggled. Oh, wow. Yo. Yeah, I think the first world reference was better than the Paris one, to be honest. Hmm. The Paris one was pretty fun to watch. It was. That freaking leg was crazy, though. <laughs> Yeah! That lady was gonna try to do whatever he can to get Chucky to marry, uh... <clears throat> Pardon me. Yeah. Uh, his dad. His dad. <laughs> yeah, so she can be president. Yeah, but he married the other one. I forgot her name. Yeah, uh, Kira. That's what. And he says first word finally. No! Yeah. <laughs> Chad's like, Chucky says first word. Yeah, but he kept saying no a lot. <laughs> it's a More good thing Chance was throwing the wedding though, because he was ring, he was ring, he was ring, he was uh, ring a long ass poem, and she was losing her patience. <laughs> 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 she didn't love Chance. She just want to be president. <laughs> yeah, he's like, once she gets what she wants, then like, okay, I want to talk to you. <laughs> Y'all, <Yep. laughs> bitch. Oh yeah, and that song, Here Comes Chucky Chan, that, that, I, I forgot about that song. Here I, Comes uh, Chucky Chan. And I think Hank sings it also. <laughs> you know, the guy that voices uh, Chef in South Park. Didn't know that. Yup. Oh. It's been a long time since I've seen that movie. Yeah, Daddy killed Chef Wong because I think oh. that died in real life. Probably. 
Well, kick her tooth through there, and she'd probably go to the dentist. Ah. Oh, there's another way to go back. Okay. That was just a dead end. Uh, I'm, not <clears throat> I'm not exactly sure if that was an actual dead end or not. End game. And no, we're not talking about the Avengers end game. No. Oh my goodness, every time I see end game, I keep thinking the Avengers now. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's the movie where, where that one guy has spoiled the ending and he got his ass beat. Oh, uh, boy, you should catch him out shot about the end yeah. of the game. Or in yeah. the video. Yeah, do we, he got deserved that. I mean, he should have mentioned it, period, but getting beaten up for it, though? No. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> That's overkill, guys. You really need to get real. <laughs> no. I mean, they, yeah. You know what I mean? They say don't spoil in game, so. Well, spoiling for one that's one thing, yes, but you don't be up somebody just for that. <laughs> yeah. Well, that was easy. Just get a gentleman and they're out of here. Seems like an ideal hiding spot. I guess so. <laughs> and that's it. That's all that's in here, as far as I know. Oh, good. So we're done with this area. Oh, nice. That was fast for uh, one part of uh, getting through hell. It looked like he's walking stationary for a brief second. <laughs> well, let's head back to the real world. Oh, to the no, mirror. Blues, blues get do. We can too. Jumps in the mirror. Well, mirror or any other thing you can jump into. Yeah. Anyway, uh, in the next video, we will head to the final area of the game and, I guess, find the Hollow King. Okay. Later, people. Or the Hollow Knight. Oh, later. Later. <laughs> that too. Later. That too.